I like to think I mix a pretty good drink, but there's always room to learn. So today I've got my buddy Bradford Anderson coming by to teach us how to make his signature Old Fashioned. You might recognize Bradford as Spinelli from General Hospital, among other things, but I know him as a master mixologist. At least a master drinker. <laughs> I love the way he makes an Old Fashioned. Thank you. You're welcome. So I asked him to come by today to show me how he does it. All right. I am of the mind that you should drink what you like. Nice. And the thing I love about the old fashioned is that you can kind of tailor it to your own taste. Right. So the, the basic ingredients always stay the same, the bourbon or the rye, um, the, the sugar and the bitters, and then you can play with the other ingredients like the club soda, the fruits, you know, you can make it sweeter, you can make it weaker. I know. Stronger. Let's go stronger. So I'm more on the traditional side, which is less fruit, mm -hmm. kind of just the, the basics. Sounds good to me. I'm ready. The ingredients we'll need to make our Old Fashioned are two ounces of bourbon or rye, your pleasure, Angostura bitters, we'll need three to four dashes of those, a sugar cube or a teaspoon of sugar, a dash of club soda, and an orange peel. First step is to drop your sugar cube into the glass. Next, we'll take the Angostura bitters and dash about three to four dashes on top of the sugar cube. Next, take the club soda and just dribble a little bit in there, enough to make an elixir. We'll muddle the sugar cube and combine the sugar, the bitters, and the club soda into one liquid. We'll add our two ounces of bourbon or rye. Then we will take our orange peel, extract the zest. Then we will add our ice, give it all a little swirl, and enjoy. <laughs> yep. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This works. <laughs> so the goal at least, is to, to accentuate the flavors of the whiskey, not cover them up. I would say you succeeded. Well, thank you, dear. Well, thank yeah. you. Hey, you have a toast for us. Uh, well, yeah. Yep. Um, may you live as long as you want, and never want as long as you live. Cheers. Cheers. For more yummy, yummy drink recipes and fun facts, don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and feel free to share your own version of your old-fashioned in the comments below. I know. <laughs> <laughs>